What's up guys, it's X2Rabby2X here, and today I'm going to be showing you uh, how to make a custom bar, I guess you could say, and how to smelt and ore into that bar. Now, this might be a fairly short tutorial, I don't know, because I usually say that, but it never ends up like that. So let's go ahead and create our um, bar, I guess. Up here we want to make a public static final item. Uh, it's called blockium bar equals no, let's call it ingot. Ingot. That sounds more Minecrafty. Uh, new item uh, blockium ingot. Now we have not created this item yet, so let's go ahead and put an ID of 602 on there. Dot set item name. Blah. This does not matter at all. Okay, so we have a declaration up here. Now let's uh, let's give it some name and whatnot. So let's go mod loader dot add name blockium ingot, which is our object. Then let's give it a name blockium ingot. And uh, I did make a. I'm just copying from the from the crossbow right now. I did make a um, a texture for it, and I'll show you that in a second. GUI items. Make sure to get the get these slashes right because usually, if your texture is not working, it's usually these stupid slashes. Blockium ingot. I th think that's what I called it. Let me actually go look at my MCP. Remember, um, when you put custom textures in here, it goes into your MCP folder bin minecraft and then just paste it right here I named it blockium bar let's go ahead and name blockium ingot if you're interested this is what it looks like it's pretty much a iron ingot but I changed the colors on it to being blockium and if you need the um, the custom blockium uh, you can find it in items.png which is located in uh, if you go back out, if you go to jars, bin, minecraft.jar, open it up with uh, WinRAR or WinRAR 7-zip. Then you're going to in, go into GUI, and then you're going to see items.png. Open that up, you'll get this, and you can copy the pictures right out of here. Now make sure the pictures are 16 by 16 pixels. And if you don't know how to do this or what kind of software you'll need for this, I have a tutorial on that in the uh, in the playlist. It should be somewhere in there. So okay, so we have our we have that, and we have our texture in there. So where's our um, ingot? It's gonna bug me. Okay, so blocking ingot, and then whoops. There we go. So now it has a name, and it has a custom te texture. And we're not going to give it a a recipe because we're actually going to smelt it. And I added this down here for my S for my notes. Let's go ahead and pretty much copy this mod loader dot add smelting with capital A capital S. And then we're going to want to go class dot object. So what do we want to put in? So we we want mod blockium. Whoops, which is our class. Our object is blockium or I think blockium block. I should probably change that to or but whatever. Oops, mis uh, misspelled that. Blockium block blo mod blockium dot blockium block and it's either dot block ID or I think it works with items also. So it's shifted index for items, dot shifted index for items. So since we're doing blocks, this is fine. And then you're going to do a comma after that, new item stack with a capital S, capital I, and another class dot object on what we want to get back, which is going to be mod blockium dot, um, what is it called? Blockium ingot. Now, on this, we don't put dot shifted index. We just, we just don't. Okay, let's, I'll just leave it at that. We don't put dot block ID or dot shifted index. And this number is how many of those bars, how many of those items do we want? 
and uh, I'll just leave it at one. So now that we have our smelting recipe, let's go. There's only one thing we have left to do, and that's um, item blockium ingot. We have to go ahead and create that class. So let's go to new class item blockium ingot. And now we don't really, this ingot doesn't have, have any special properties. So to make this easy, just go into one of your other item classes, like item blocking crossbow. And you only need to copy the constructor. We don't really care about this because you're not, the bar does not have, I mean the ingot does not have any useful properties. Like you can't right click it and it does stuff. So and just copy down constructor in here. Make sure to replace your name, custom block, um, oops, ingot, and, uh, oops, make sure this extends, uh, item. And then we have our super X, whatever, and a max stack size. Since it's an ingot, we want to make this 64 instead of 1. So let's go ahead and save that. Our mod block game should be without errors which it is and let's go um, let's go ahead and recompile let's go to our MCP recompile now we'll be doing a tutorial after this on tools so we'll put that um, blockium ingot to use and then I will also be doing a tutorial on armor so we'll have another use for our blockium ingot so it's pretty much like I'm just going to make everything out of Blockium. Okay, so we have that recompiled. Let's start a client. Hopefully, we don't get any errors. Oh no! How did I think this was going to. This is what was going to do it. Okay. Could not find Blockium ingot. How could you not find Blockium. Blockium, block, Blockium ingot? Oh, blocking ingot.png. Make sure to put that ending on there. Wow, I'm I'm getting terrible at this. So yeah, blocking ingot.png. Do not forget that PNG on there. Let's go ahead and recompile yet again. La di da di da. And now I'm gonna cut a little in uh in game because I'm gonna have to create a is it done? Yes, it's done. I'm have to, gonna have to create a furnace, and I'm gonna have to burn some wood real quick. So I don't just to make this video a little shorter. I won't put that on there, but let's just see if it works. Let's create a new world survival. And I'm also gonna need to find a blocking block, which would not not be hard to do, because I did make him really really common. Generating levels, saving chunks. Ah, it really snow biome. Well, this is. Oh, I saw lights. I knew that was a blocking block right off the bat. All right, so I'll be back. I'm gonna cut this out, and I'm gonna get some wood and pretty much make myself all the things I need. So uh, I'll be back. All right, what's up, guys? I'm back, and uh, I have my little hut right here, and uh, I have this furnace. I made myself some charcoal. Which, after I made it, I found out that was really pointless because I just could have used some sticks and wood. So whatever, but uh, let's see if this works. So we have some blockium ore. I did call it ore in this inside the game. I didn't call it block, which is kind of cool. And when you power it up and smelt it in, in game, you get a blockium ingot. And that kind of looks cool. I mean, I don't know. I like those colors. And you see, uh, we've increased the size of the stack, so you can get more than one. And, uh, yeah, I mean, let's see, we have three of them. Now, we don't have a recipe or anything yet for blocking pickaxe, but just wait for it. It's going to come, and it's going to look like this. So make sure to watch out for the next uh, next tutorial. Oops. So, yeah, uh, make sure to like the video if you liked it. Subscribe for more videos. Uh, put some suggestions and comments in the... I mean, suggestions and questions in the comments. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See you.